I'm putting too much thought into this. I'm, I'm don't, I don't actually remember what the difference between the, these two are. So, I'll do order and discipline now because it's the left one. Purpose. Oh, that's a pretty good header. Neighborhood watch. We need to mobilize and stand together to help people in need and protect them from troublemakers. New building, watchtower. Watchtower increased the hope of pe people living nearby. You will have to build two watchtowers. Yeah, okay, sure. Oh, good job. We need someone to keep the peace and watch for trouble. A volunteer force would be better, but I'm glad we'll have them. Watchtower. People working near watchtowers are protected by their neighbors serving as watchmen. They feel safer and are more hopeful. An outpost can be set up here, delivering an estimated 150 food every one day. Send an outpost team to build an outpost. A tall snow cliff. There's a hole in it, and it's inhabited. You can see lone figure bustling about. Sure, let's go and see what the, the dude is about. The Londoners, the unconvinced want to leave. Sir, you've convinced the majority, but the hope is low. A group of our people are still scared. Still so scared that they want to flee the city for London in 15 days. They've come to try to change your mind. Calm down. We're not going to die. <laughs> but the moment there's nine. The tendency is the group of people may join the Londoners. We have researched the hothouse. 20 wood and a steam core. Sure. A bit of heat up there. There we go. As promised, you built and manned uh, watchtowers to maintain order in city. Hope rises. Uh, what should we research? A better medical outpost. People are hungry. The food problem. Captain, some of our people are here to talk about the lack of food. They've been hungry for days now. Let's feed them and stockpile some food. Have, you'll have three days to feed everyone and uh, stockpile 54 food rations. I think this is possible to do, actually. Let's do the bigger one. Feed all the hungry. 13 people. Refusal to work. A man assigned to an emergency shift has refused to work. He said he's already worn out and he doesn't want to end up dead like one of his friends. Let him rest. It's one that will rise slightly. And will rise if we force him. The hole in the snow cliff leads to a small chamber. Someone lives here, but the lonely human figure we saw from afar has disappeared. After the starving city fell into chaos, its leader, an army captain, appointed himself an absolute ruler. Plenty of people, disgruntled, deserted the city, and most of the others rebelled against him. We discovered a shrouded cave and freshwater springs. Let's go to the shrouded cave then. Promise broken. I broke the promise? Wait, wait what, what? I did? What? Oh, man. What the hell? I thought I kept you warm. Well, that was a mistake. Oh, no. I'm screwed. <laughs> okay. Eating. That one. Abort that one. Eating. Do that one instead. We are going to have to build a few houses. Let's get that going. Yes, the generator upgrade. Thank you. What are we going to research next? Steam hub, I guess. Gotta keep shit warm. Children's hideout. This cave is a hideout for some children who were evacuated from winter home. We talked to the children in the hideout. They said that one night their teachers and some hunters took them out from Winterhome on a secret adventure. It seems that these kids were evacuated in time before things in their city got really ugly. Ooh. I'm not going to send the children alone. I don't have the heart for it. <laughs> and let's research something new. Steel sometime soon, so let's research that. Purpose or adaption. We'll still go with purpose. Morning gathering. 
Morning gatherings will slightly raise hope from time to time. Hope will rise slightly. Listen, everyone. New law is signed. Man. Lana's gained more followers, right? Oh, but also, <laughs> the steelworks are is the resources, coal mining. Let's go. Uh, yep, those are the steelworks. Shit, we're gonna run right, right low. Oof. This is gonna be interesting. Let's lower the heating. Yeah, that's gonna improve the situation somewhat. Alright. Coal mining researched. Fuck, I need a steam core to do that. I didn't notice. I didn't notice. Fucking hell. Okay, this is gonna be really tight. <laughs> right. Wall drill. That's next. Oh, that's also gonna need. Okay, good thing he's bringing a lot of steam cores. Jesus. We we'll create one of those. And we send it out to scout. Wall drill. Yes. Bring it on. Resources. Still need. <laughs> we can do, select a new bit, piece of research, though. Probably gonna need. I'm oh, gonna need heaters, though. So I'm gonna go for that one. Let's see. Foreman. Your ability, Foreman, increases the efficiency of a workplace by 40. Ooh, okay. Cost 10 food rations. Aha, that's the cost. I have to provide him with food. That's actually quite a good deal. I'll take that one. All right, a lot of children, a lot of wood, a lot of coal, uh, some coal, and a few of those cores, so sweet, sweet cores. Now, let's see. We're going to need a coal mine. Let's get that done immediately. And also a wall drill. Where are you? Wall drill. Put one here. He's going to need to go all the way back here. Three days. Peter's researched and upgrade. We're out of steel. Fighting arena. Trouble with Londoners writing on the wall. Captain, someone has defaced the walls with predictions of doom for our city. This is troubling. People. Already fear will share Winterhome's fate, and scared minds are swayed by even the smallest of nudges. <sighs> Send watchmen to remove it. Generator efficiency upgrade. 10% less coal. Low coal! Yeah, I know, I know, I know. Okay, that was a generator efficiency. And now for the coal mining optimization. Coal mining optimization has been achieved. No! No! Are you fucking kidding me? I was just messing around. <laughs> Fucking hell. A pub, just like in London. Let's call it the pipe and hole. <laughs> okay, sure. Call it whatever you want. The coal mine was in operation until very recently. The machinery isn't running now, but there doesn't seem to be anything wrong with it. We could retrieve plenty of raw materials if we took the machinery apart. Only take the stored coal, dismantle it for resources. Yeah, we'll do that. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the game followers. Yeah, of course they do. <laughs> Discontent is very high. <laughs> Fucking hell. Okay. Let's see.
Infirmary. Take steam core. Steam heated infirmary with 10 beds. The sick are treated faster than a medical post, and the greatly ill can be treated safely and reliably. Infirmary. Yes. Law. Moonshine. Every meal slightly lowers discontent. Eating soup causes less discontent. Alright. People get some alcohol every day to cheer them up. <laughs> that's that's an old trick. <laughs> Nothing wrong with a stiff drink from time to time. Well, hold on a second. Make coal from wood, you say. It produces three coal for each wood. Interesting. How much does the sawmill produce? No, no, not sawmill. The wall drill. 160. That is a quite a big surplus, actually. Let's 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 make the kiln. Ooh, we have a surplus. We have l fewer sick people than we have uh, hospital beds. That is good. What am I in need of the most? I think maybe coal, actually. So I should probably go for the steam coal mine. Start that research. Poking around the trees marked with crosses, we found shallow graves under each of them. The dead bodies lack most of the bigger muscles, and some bones bear signs of a cutting tool. The corpses have been obviously stripped of edible parts. Now we know what kept the survivors by freshwater springs from starving. We'll leave graves intact, but we can cut the trees for wood. That's dark, though. Jesus. Bring two steam cores. Get a steel and whatever. Send this party to the gloomy cave. And we also need to put up one of those steam hubs. Uh, let's see. Where do we want to put it? Let's see, let's put it right about here, I think. Kinda wanted to go here. You know, if I build this street a bit further, maybe just by that much. Yeah. One hour and 40 minutes left. No way. No, I'm not gonna make it in time though. That's too sad. Too bad. Yeah, yeah. Oh no. <laughs> nah, now it's done. Now it's too late though. Now it's too late. Ah, uh, of course it is. There's also something I needed to build. Yes, steam coal mine. Uh, cold homes. Start he start heating 30 cold homes within 24 hours, then keep them heated for two days. 15. Livable. They're now a chili. See. Okay, now let's see. Here we go. <laughs> Bring on the heat. <laughs> Another theft happened. 143 votes from the stockpile. And, and guards. Caught in the act. Our guards did a good job. They got the goods back, but are more importantly, they caught one of the thieves. Let him go, but we'll prepare a place for him soon. After three days, we build a prison. Banish him. The person will leave the city forever. We'll build a prison. We'll make that work. Hope rises. Whoa, wow! That's a big jump. Order above all. Now we're well and truly city of order. Glorious. May the flag fly our s over our city forever. Order dawns on our city. <laughs> Jesus. We're all buying into it. Okay, food, industrial hothouse. 
People regain hope. For the first time, the Londoners have failed to persuade anyone to abandon our city and flee to London. People are recovering from their shock at the news of Winterhome and starting to hope for the future. Good. No place for the weak. This fishing village used to supply Tesla City with food. Searching it, we found a letter. Mike, don't return to the city. Tesla's a madman. There will be blood, that's for sure. And soon. The village was left in order. We could send a team here to start fishing. Tesla City. Alright. Uh, purpose. Prison. We will build a prison. Man, 40 steel? God damn. Hope rises again. Tesla City. Thunder unleashed. A central tall tower shines with blue glow of electric discharges, which form a protective dome over the city, over the town. But something went wrong here. There are charred bodies lying in the streets. We found the dreadnought landing. Risk entering the city. Or stay away from the city. We're going to risk it. We enter the city. We've seen a thing or two in our lives, but nothing has ever frightened us as much as a blasted lightning. Until we figured out how to switch it off, that is. Now we'll be able to establish an outpost here. Ooh, cool. <gasps> a steam core every day! Holy shit. That's... That's... That's significant. That's what that is. Poet Suicide. Sir, one of our people has committed suicide, and in his spare time he wrote poems about loss, suffering, and the death of hope. Our propaganda center waged a campaign against him to protect our people from his influence. Now people might blame us for our suicide, unless we make it look like he drank himself to death. Discontent will rise slightly. Oh, we'll have to discontent instead of the hope. Uh, yeah, we need more steel, as we always do. Now we can build steel steamworks. Hmm. The hungry were fed. Hope rises. Oh, the Londoners are rem losing people to their cause. Yes. One of our people became bra bravely ill due to frostbite. This will keep happening if people have to work in such cold. Losing a limb, one of our people has to undergo an amputation. Working in the freezing cold, nothing such severe frostbite that there's no. Uh... Let's make three of them. We are starting to run low on coal. Medical post. Uh, inoperative. Okay. That doesn't work. Hmm. Yeah, that's a lot of houses, too. <sighs> Can't turn that one off. Mm, the wall drill. Wait, wait, wait. We... That's not, not necessary. There's still a day left. We can do this. And that will make it better. Will it? An hour. This, though. That would make a difference. First London is convinced to stay. Sir, several of the people who wanted to flee to London have decided to trust you and stay. <laughs> See, do we have any thing cheap? Hunter's gear? Sure. It's only wood. People are becoming ill because of the frostbite. How are we doing consumption-wise? We're all producing. We can probably manage. Boost it a bit.
All right. Okay. Don't need that. Okay, now we're at the surplus again. Probably don't need these. Same goes for this one. Let's turn those off. Alright. Now we're producing a healthy surplus. Uh, let's see. Do we want to free it? No, we want the better uh, automatons. Kind of making a bet on them. Order. Or purpose, rather. <clears throat> Ooh. That's probably making myself a myself king. <laughs> Agitator. Raises the efficiency of nearby workers by 20%. Willing informers, some workers want to see you. They've dragged an engineer with them, accusing him of disloyalty. He was reading us this, trying to turn us against you. One of the workers shoves a tattered book into your hands. Damned fools, snarls the engineer. It's Dickens. I've been trying to educate them. <laughs> you will gain three informers. The engineer will get hurt. Hope will fa fall. How much hope will I lose? Uh, not an insignificant, insignificant amount. 